We'll bring the mayor up and we're going to do things a little differently. Just bear with us. It's still going to be a great night. And I'm ready for the lights. How about you? And how about the Rockview Choir? Wow, very, very nice. Let's bring up right now, if you don't mind, Pastor Willie J. Freeman, Greater Missionary Baptist Church, for the invocation. Let us pray. Our God and our Father, how excellent is thy name in all the earth. We come to say thank you because you are creed of every good and perfect gift. We thank you for this gathering. We ask that you keep us safe. We pray for those that uh, organize and orchestrate this uh, event tonight. We pray for our local officials, our state officials, our national figures. We pray for those uh, our men and women who are serving our military, those who are serving in harm's way. We pray for our retired and veterans. And we thank you for all that you've done and all that you're going to do. And Lord, as we embark upon this season of Thanksgiving, season of celebration, we ask that you would help us to remember that Jesus is the reason for the season. So we thank you now. We ask that you forgive us of all of our sin and help us to be able to mind your presence. Lord, thank you again for all that you've done for us, all that you're going to do. We ask now in a special way that you bless the mayor and you know, those that are uh, elected officials that give leadership to this uh, city. And we thank you for the city. We thank you for the people of Rockville that you continue to be with us, that you continue to help us to look to you and trust you. And so again, we thank you for all that you've done and all that you're going to do. Keep us and strengthen us now. Lord, help us. You always be mindful for your presence. We thank you and we love you for all that you've done and all that you're going to do for us. In Jesus' great big name we pray and ask these blessings. Amen. Amen. All right. All right. Well, there you go. My name is JT Daniel. And this is my daughter, Dawson. I knew, I knew the Rocky Choir wouldn't let me down. Now, it takes a lot to put an event like this on, and at this time, to mention some of the people that are involved, and it takes, like I said, a lot of people. Let's bring out someone who knows an awful lot about it. Put your hands together for our Clarksville Mayor, Mayor McMillan. to enjoy the 
beautiful display. It will be lighted every night from now until Christmas, except in inclement weather, which we hope we don't have um, as we go forward. So take the opportunity to bring your families down here, see this beautiful display, and remember, give the thanks to Parks and Recreation and the Street Department for all their hard work. Thank you. All right, let's hear it for Clarks for Mayor Kim McMillan. And I'm making it official. Anytime I go anywhere to speak or do anything in front of people, I'm bringing the choir with me. That makes it real easy. Well, Merry Christmas, to Happy Thanksgiving, and all that stuff. Um, again, an event like this does take a whole lot of support from the community, and we have a fantastic community, as you can see, many of the members here tonight and the mayor. Uh, but it also takes a, a group. It also takes a group of uh, supporters in the community and businesses to get behind an event like this. I want to thank the sponsors for a moment. It won't be long before we light this thing up, so bear with us. Uh, U.S. Bank, The Leaf Chronicle, Clarksville Family Magazine, Lamar Advertising, and the City of Clarksville. I want to be a, say a big shout out to the Clarksville Online guys here. And you know, you can see an awful lot of photographs in all of these areas uh, all day tomorrow and throughout the rest of the year as uh, we gear up for a wonderful season here along the river. Um, and we're getting ready to turn on the lights. Um, and I know that there's, a, there's a special guest here with us. I don't, I don't see um, Weatherbird Snowbird. Is Weatherbird Snowbird with us? I believe if you pay, are we bringing Weatherbird Snowbird out now? Where is Weatherbird Snowbird? Hi guys, how you doing? How about this weather? Oh now, don't turn rowdy on me. Remember, I don't create the weather, I just report it. I'm just one bird. Plus, it's a union thing. Rain is not in my department. Do you guys need some more snow days next winter? Yeah! Well, pass your lunch money forward. I'll see what I can do. This works at elementary schools, let me tell you. I didn't get to be this, this round just by looking at food, and I get all that from all my 20s and 50s from the teachers. They're some of my best customers, you know. Well, you guys have fun. Watch me this winter on Channel 4, and maybe I'll say, Montgomery County, no school, no school.
coming on Christmas even though it's 62 and balmy. All right, I want to thank all of you in the back too. People, we know you're back there, and uh, we're glad you're part of this fantastic celebration. All right, let's figure this out. We had uh, we had the mayor, we had the pastor, the mayor, we had the city council, we have Snowbird, a bunch of soggy guests. What's missing, kids? Yeah, the jolly old elf in red is missing. We have the mayor in red. And the next would be the Jolly Old Elf in Red. I think the way, set, the, way uh, the Jolly Old Elf in Red works is if you scream really loud when I tell you, he'll hear you and come into this area. Do you think it'll work? Let's, let, let's try it. We're going to count to three, and then I want you to scream your lungs out. Ready? One, two, three. Okay, no, no, no. I think he heard. I think he heard you. And now I think he's dead. He might not hear the next one. We're going to try it anyway. Jolly Old Elf in Red. On three. One, two, three. And I believe he's there on three. And I think he's here. One, two, three. Boys and girls, ladies and gentlemen, let's welcome the Jolly Old Elf in Red. Santa Claus. Hey kids, this is what happens when you eat spinach. You become a lark elf. Let's hear it for the Rock Deep Choir. Brave in the elements. Santa has a soggy beard, but he's a trooper. Are we ready? We're going to count down from five. I need your help. Audience, are you ready? Are we ready? Are we ready here? Are we ready? Here we go. Five, four, three, two, one. Light her up. There you go. That looks fantastic. Thank you all for coming to the 13th Annual Christmas on the Cumberland Celebration. Remember, the event is open nightly and now through January 3rd. You can visit cityofclarksville.com for a complete schedule of free weekend activities. Be sure to celebrate yet another Clarksville tradition downtown for the holidays. We'll see you there on December 3rd. And on behalf of the city, Clarksville, and all of the event sponsors, have a safe and happy holiday season. Enjoy Clarksville's beautiful Festival of Lights. Good night. Drive safe.